happiness, uh, thankfulness, uh, rejoicing. Those are just a few words to describe a Waco family today after their loved one finally leaves the hospital after months of fighting COVID-19. 62 days to be exact. That's how long he spent in the hospital fighting the deadly virus. Tonight, that family finally feeling some intense relief. 25 News reporter Joe Lopez has the exclusive on how one Waco man went from a coma to taking his first steps to recovery. Freddie Guerrero was hospitalized for 62 days after contracting coronavirus. And after many highs and lows in the process, today family was able to celebrate him finally going home, a day some weren't so sure would happen. On a rainy Wednesday at Baylor Scott and White in Waco. We didn't know if this day was going to come. We always, we never lost faith and we never lost hope. There was a silver lining as family members of Freddie Guerrero celebrated their loved one as he beat all odds and survived coronavirus. Welcome home, baby. You get to sleep in your own bed tonight. We love you, brother. We love you. Back in June, Guerrero, along with over 20 other family members, all contracted the virus. All of them went through it, some better than others. Uh, he was the one that it really just took hold of. Leaving Guerrero bouncing between hospitals for over 62 days. And at one point, was in a medically induced coma. For him to overcome and embrace what he had to do to fight, to live, he's a fighter. Good, two more, you got it. Guerrero had to learn how to walk, Nine. how to talk, even how to eat again, inspiring everyone around him. It's just an amazing thing because you get to see that story from where you were practically what he said, you know, I almost didn't make it to walking out of a hospital is amazing. Because of his treatment, Guerrero is still struggling to speak, but family members say he's excited to be with his wife and dogs and sleep in his own bed. It's just um, an overwhelming, overwhelming feeling of, of happiness and, and joy and uh, just pride. Guerrero strong. Guerrero still has months of treatment ahead of him, but the family is excited to find a way to safely celebrate his birthday, which is in just a couple of weeks. Reporting in Waco, Joel Lopez, 25 News.